Welcome to the Options Beginner Series once again. And in this course, we're going to look at long puts. Long puts means we're going to buy put options and we're going to use FXC, the Euro ETF, for this example. Although we've seen a couple of smaller examples, we're going to look at the put option just like we did in uh, the first two courses on uh, buying a call option as well as selling a call option. And what we're going to do is identify a candidate, uh, a suitable candidate for the put option. Then we're going to try to create a trade rationale. We look at charts, we look at the analysis and uh, see what the charts are telling us. And then once we know what we want to do, then our decisions are based upon uh, the choice of expiry series, uh, the choice of moneyness, and then we'll also look at margin requirements, the Greeks and the profit and loss and stuff like that. So this course is on a put option and the candidate that I've selected is the FXE. The FXE is the Euro ETF. So the FXE in general will mirror the uh, US dollar Euro spot trading rates. So here we see that the Euro is currently trading at about $131.93. So this is the FXE. And if you look at a one-year chart of the FXE, we can see that uh, it hit a high last, uh, last year in May of about 148. And since then, the euro has been on a downtrend. Whenever you see a chart from the top left to the bottom right, you know that's a clear downtrend. And um, yesterday, uh, Spain got downgraded two notches. Uh, so the euro problems are still very persistent. And they might have some near-term fixes and some uh, quantitative easing programs, just like we do in the, in the US. These are all temporary band-aids. And uh, the euro is uh, on a long-term decline against the US dollar. And you can see that in this uh, in, in this one year chart. Now, also, if you if you notice, the last few days the euro has been going up. So it was at at uh, at uh, the 130 level uh, about two weeks ago, and then since then it's just been steadily moving up. So the why I'm choosing this as a candidate for my put option is if I can see the previous uh, three to four months. It goes up, it comes down, it goes up, it comes down, it goes up, it comes down. Uh, and uh, it's just finished its two-week uh, up move here. I expect it to come down to about 130. I think we can make uh, a quick profit if, if it does that. And so I want to buy a put option. So I want to capitalize on the move downward in the euro.